Finley's mayor giving her annual State of the City address tonight, focusing on housing and infrastructure. WTOL 11's Dom O'Neill joins us live in studio with the details from tonight's address. What did you find out, Dom? Well, Jeff, Finley's mayor says she's committed to working on things like improving and investing in more recreation opportunities. And one of the main takeaways for 2024 is the city's focus on downtown redevelopment, flood mitigation, and adding to downtown recreational areas. In laying out a vision for Finley, Mayor Christina Mern says the focus will be housing, transportation, infrastructure, and flood mitigation. Um, you know, we've seen a little bit of slowdown because of funding delays for flood mitigation, but we continue to be committed to getting flood mitigation resolved in our community, and that's going to continue to be a big focus this year. Mern says flood mitigation involves five key projects. Two are underway and pretty much complete. The final ones deal with the Eagle Creek Basin, the Norfolk Southern Railroad Bridge. Um, so those have been delayed because of cost inflations. We're seeking out a flood hazard mitigation grant from the federal government. We hope to have more information on that later this year. In the meantime, she says there are plans to focus on recreation throughout Finley with the hopes of trail expansion happening in the next couple of years. Um, and then we'll continue to work west out to Litzenberg Park, but all of that will kind of also go through the downtown recreation area that we're hoping will be able to begin construction probably in 2026 as well. Site Selection Magazine tabbed Finley as a top micropolitan area in 2022, and the mayor says she wants to see that momentum continue. Exciting things are ahead for the city of Finley, and I'm excited to continue to lead the city of Finley. And the mayor says they will be doing a lot of community engagement over the next six months, and she hopes the input they get will really change the landscape of Finley's downtown. She also adds she hopes Finley will continue to be a place where businesses and people will want to invest in. Reporting in studio, Dominique O'Neill, WTOL 11.